truck parked in his south side driveway. Neighbors tell Action News Jax they targeted at least one other truck on the same street. In the report we obtained in the last half hour, police say they're looking for five suspects now. Action News Jax Russell Colburn just spoke with a victim who says this could have been far worse. The truck was right here in the driveway like it is now. The doors were left unlocked, which the owner regrets. But thankfully, the suspects were captured on those surveillance cameras. It's four in the morning Wednesday at a home near Bay Meadows Road. The victim has asked us to not give specifics on the location, but you can see at the top of your screen two cars pull up. Two of the suspects go right for the truck and get in. A third person joins them, and a fourth tries the car on the right, but it's locked. All four end up rummaging through the truck, the whole thing lasting just more than a minute. I'd say 99% of the time it's locked. It all happened while Justin Dewey and his wife and two young daughters slept inside. Very thankful there wasn't anything in there, and um, very thankful that they didn't come in the house. Dewey says they didn't get anything of value, but this wasn't the only truck they hit. Uh, opened my, my truck door, and my center console was lifted up. Chris Mielli lives right down the street. I'm like, that's weird. I don't know why that was open. I started looking around, and I guess that garage door opener was right there, some packet knives right there. Nothing was taken, and the back seat's filled with all my tools. So I think I got lucky. A close call for both, and now both want the same thing. They need to stop, you know, they need to stop doing this because they're going to get bigger trouble or hurt at some point. So let's hope they get caught. What do we found especially disturbing about that video and what it has to do with his garage? All new at 5. On the South Side, Russell Colburn, CBS 47 Action News Jacks.